Hello everyone, this is, hold on, something's not right here. Hold on, let me see something. Hello everyone, this is Psycho Blue Art 2K here, bringing you a special video announcement. And well, obviously I'm showing my face because I set a goal of mine when I did this channel that if I ever hit 125 subs, I would do face videos, face cam vids for my Power Rangers and Vanguard. And I hit that goal. I didn't think I was going to hit that goal, to be honest. And, well, I decided, why not? And I just want to say thank you to all the people who sub to me, comment to me, like my channel, like the rage I do, because I do a lot of rage, obviously, <laughs> and everything. I am very thankful for your guys' support, honestly. I didn't think I was going to hit that goal ever, or actually do a channel. Because when I did YouTube, I got it around 2006. I did a YouTube channel. But I didn't do nothing at the time because at the time I couldn't think of anything to do. I was undecisive of what I wanted to do. And my first video I ever did was Yu-Gi-Oh! Deck Profile because... Well... I was playing Yu-Gi-Oh! at the time, competitive. And, well, my favorite deck was Chaos... Chaos Warns, Light Warns with... Well, Chaos Dragon. Chaos Dragon is my favorite deck. And I liked it. And then when they got hit, I kind of fixed some stuff around. So that was my first video I did. I wanted to do deck profiles, but... <clears throat> Sorry about that. The thing about Yu-Gi-Oh! is... It's expensive. You always have to keep making decks. And that was tough. So I took a break. From, I retired from Yu-Gi-Oh! Competitive. And I just focused on other stuff. And while... This Power Ranger game was announced. I was happy because I grew up with Power Rangers. Mighty Morphin was my season I started off with because I was around that time. And me and my brother and sisters loved it a lot. My parents even took us to go see the movie when it was coming out and it was packed. And I was happy because I got to see, well, obviously my favorite Ranger is T Billy followed by Tommy. I wasn't a big fan of Jason. <laughs> Not a Jason guy. And, well, it was good seeing something like that. It blew up pretty big, and I stuck to Power Rangers. And as I got older, I started watching Super Sentai. And, obviously, Kamen Rider. I was a big fan of those. It was interesting something new, opposite from Power Rangers. It was different storytelling. I liked it. And, well, when I got into Legacy Wars, it was new to me. I didn't know what to do, how to do it. And there was four big YouTubers for Power Rangers that I actually followed and like. We started off with Timmy Boy. Timmy Boy was one of the ones I subscribed to and I liked his channel. It was funny, it was unique, and I felt like he was the first turtle player and I hate that. But I liked his, his content, it was fun. And then there was Jonathan Snow. I liked his channel. It was interesting, it was good to see someone who knew Ranger stuff as well. But it also felt good having someone that had problem pronouncing things like I did. And it was good. I mean, I pronounced a lot of names wrong. I butchered a lot of things. And I just, the way I speak. And I liked his channel because it was like, man, someone else has the same problem I do when it comes to speaking. And then Pirate Chambers was next. And I liked his content. It was good. He read comic books and I liked that because I was, I was intrigued in Power Rangers stories in comic books. I liked his challenge he did. I think he did Ranger Roulette, which was new to me. I never seen someone do challenges like that by just by the spin of wheel. And I liked it. I'm glad he came back again. It was good watching that. And then obviously, of course, the number one person I subbed first was Wolf Thunder Ranger, Korak himself. And a very good friend to me. I consider like a homie and a brother to me. Because his channel opened up so much for me. Made me have confidence because here was this guy who, well, here was this guy who had this never give up attitude and this personality. Like, he could throw challenges at him and he'll do it until he beats it, no matter how bad he lost. And his personality was just good. Yeah, he had some rocky stuff in the beginning, but as time progressed, he got better. And then on that, I was actually happy when he won Mobile, Mobile Master Championship because he proved everyone wrong. And, well, I love this channel. And when I started YouTube, I was known as R2K Dev. And then after the course of the years, I became Psycho Blue because, well, 
Honestly, I became Psycho Blue because he ate a Popeye's chicken on his video. And, well, I was mad because at the time Popeye chickens was hard to get. And he rubbed it in my face in a way. So I became Psycho Blue R2K because obviously we all know who the Psycho Challenger is. He throws challenges for Wolf and he made his own Psycho team. So I chose Blue because that's my favorite color. Power Rangers in Space is my favorite season. And the Psycho Ranger are my favorite villains. And I love Blue. He was crazy. So I chose Psycho Blue. R2K. And I made sure I gave the Wolf Thunder Ranger a living hell with challenges. I still give him a little hell, but you know, he made me confident enough to make a YouTube channel. Or not a YouTube channel, more like upload videos. Because the one thing he said is I have a lot of rage issues. <laughs> I rage a lot and it's fun. People like rage stuff. And yeah, I do rage. I try not to rage. I try not to cuss because I want viewers, but at the same time, can't help it. I can't control that sometimes. And well, for me, I was just happy getting views. As long as I posted something and I got views, I was happy with that. But I didn't expect to get so many views so fast and so many subscribers that fast, honestly. And well, I am thankful for him and I'm thankful for all the fan base that like my channel and subbed. And I like to help all the other YouTube channels who are doing the same thing. Like Expanse, Serena, a lot of people who are doing channels. And I'd like to thank Expanse, I'd like to thank Arcade X, I'd like to thank Lewis Curse, I'd like to thank Wolf Gaming channel, I'd like to thank Wiz Gaming, I'd like to thank OG Nakao, I'd like to thank uh, Pajo channel, I'd like to thank, I forgot the other person, but I'd like to thank a lot of people who have been commenting, subbing, requesting videos. Solar Ranger, Event Diaz. All you guys who are subbing and requesting videos has making me build content. And also, I'm thankful for that. And also, be I started doing my own series because I always felt anyway I needed to fix certain characters. And I got tired of always seeing these meta characters. And I got tired of always seeing buffs to characters that I needed. So I decided to make a series on that. And I like the series. It's my little child in a way. And also, I'm starting to also assist ones because I feel like assist needed. it. Can't have a video without Cyrus, people. <laughs> That's how it is. But I am thankful for you guys. So expect more contact with my cam in it, my face on it, where you can see my re rage and talk. So thank you guys for subbing and helping me gain more confidence when I needed it. So this is Psycho Blue R2K saying peace and have a good day.